that maybe I'm dreaming. The city of Grass Valley, located within Nevada County, California, is among one of the most desirable places to live in the state. The county of Nevada is a growing county and is nestled in the beautiful foothills of the Sierra Nevada mountain range. With a rich and colorful history that dates back to the gold rush era, it is a popular place to live, work, and recreate. Our city population is just over 13,000. There exists a balance of rural, residential, commercial, and industrial areas throughout the city's 3.7 square miles. The city of Grass Valley is within walking distance to Empire Mine State Historic Park, which is in excess of 800 acres. The city is also a short drive to several large lakes and magnificent Lake Tahoe, towering mountains, and nearby world-class ski resorts. A noted recreational attraction within just a few minutes of Grass Valley is beautiful South Yuba River State Park, reaching more than 22 miles into the Sierra Nevada with its fantastic beaches, waterfalls, swimming, and offering challenging whitewater rafting and kayaking. The Grass Valley Police Department is located in the downtown area. The police department offers its citizens and employees valuable resources. Some of the equipment available to the officers includes up-to-date computer equipment and a firing range used exclusively by members of the Grass Valley Police Department and the Sierra College Administration of Justice training programs. The department also offers a free membership to two local first-class health clubs. Department structure includes officers assigned to the patrol division, sergeants who are responsible for infield supervision, and captains who oversee administrative and patrol duties. The administration consists of two captains and chief. The largest and by far the most visible division of the uh, police department is the patrol division. Officers are assigned to one-man patrol duties unless accompanied by a reserve officer. An assignment to the patrol division carries a great degree of responsibility, but it also offers a variety of opportunities. Whether it is routine patrol in a rural area or foot patrol in a downtown area, officers are expected to maintain a high degree of visibility and to approach law enforcement from a community policing view, keeping in mind the need for interaction and problem solving with citizens and downtown merchants. Although officers are expected to perform a community relations role in the area, they're also expected to perform a full range of law enforcement duties such as issuing citations, conducting criminal investigations, and apprehending suspects. Special duty assignments include the investigations division in which the officer is responsible for all major investigations including narcotic investigations, traffic and motor officer positions responsible for selective traffic enforcement and traffic accident investigation, and a school resource officer responsible for enforcing laws and establishing relationships with students at city schools. All special duty assignments receive extra monetary compensation. During the summer months, the city of Grass Valley downtown area is host to numerous special events and street fairs. During this time, the police department assigns several officers to bicycle patrol for selective enforcement needs and community relations. Finally, there is the Grass Valley Police Department Special Incident Team. This is a highly trained and motivated group of officers that are responsible for the handling of all major incidents such as barricaded suspects, hostage situations, and high-risk warrant service. Drawn from the patrol staff, these officers undergo vigorous training in special weapons handling, tactical deployment, and resource utilization in order to achieve their goal. Specially equipped, these officers train with and compete against SWAT teams throughout the state to ensure that their skills are honed to perfection. The Grass Valley Police Department is proud to support a reserve unit. While there are a minimum number of hours that the reserve must work, the department understands the time constraints on these individuals and, with rare exception, allows the reserves to schedule their own working hours. Once employed by the police department as a reserve, all equipment is provided. Although reserves are employed in a level two or backup role, they are expected to perform many of the same functions as the regular officers and are considered to be an integral part of the patrol staff. 
For the proactive reserve officer, there are opportunities to be involved with routine patrol, traffic enforcement, and assistance in undercover investigations, narcotic raids, and high-risk felony encounters. Regardless of the task, our reserves are held to the same degree of professionalism as that of the regular officers. The Grass Valley Police Department is continuously recruiting for qualified reserve applicants. The testing process for a reserve officer is much the same as that of a full-time officer, although there is no written examination required for the reserve applicants. Full-time applicants for the Grass Valley Police Department face a written test, followed by a rigorous physical agility examination. The physical agility is a practical test of one's ability to handle the physical rigors of a police officer position. The physical agility test must be taken and passed on a quarterly basis by all officers. The first portion of the physical agility test is the mile run, which you must complete in less than nine minutes. The next portion of the test is a stair climb event, which tests the applicant's lower body strength and endurance. The applicant must climb a flight of stairs, proceed up and over the railing, and then back down the stairs three times within the allotted time period. In this event, the applicant must clear a six-foot chain-link fence and then climb the stairs on the training tower. Following the training tower, there is a 50-yard sprint to a small obstacle course, then run to the finish line within the allotted time. The next event is the bag carry, which tests the applicant's upper body strength and thought process under physical stress. Carrying and dragging an approximate 70-pound bag, the applicants must wind their way through a number of obstacles within the maximum allowable time. The final event is the scramble which tests the applicant's endurance and agility. The applicant must proceed under and over several obstacles that simulate those that are likely to be found in street situations. The final testing phase is the oral board. Applicants face a battery of questions and must demonstrate their ability to think quickly and communicate. Once hired, the Grass Valley police officer will look forward to an ongoing process of in-service training in the areas of officer safety tactics and weaponless defense. The Grass Valley Police Department offers a tremendous opportunity to outgoing and enterprising individuals looking for a rewarding law enforcement career. The Grass Valley Police Department is a community-oriented police department and we are always looking for officers and recruits who want to make a difference in our community. The department itself is not only aggressive toward reducing the effects of the criminal element, but is also progressive in its attitude toward the quality of work life. When choosing a profession, one must also examine the area in which he or she will live. The city of Grass Valley offers a quality of life that many have come to enjoy and appreciate. Well, my name is Alex, and uh, I went up to school in Spokane, Washington, but I grew up around here, and when I was done with college, I came back to the police, or actually back to Grass Valley, uh, which is my hometown, and I wanted to get into law enforcement. And what I really wanted to do was work in my hometown because I wanted to serve the community that I've grown up in. So um, I applied to the Grass Valley Police Department. I've been with the police department for a little bit over a year now, and I really enjoy my job. What I, what I enjoy about working for the Grass Valley Police Department is not only working with a great bunch of uh, individuals, but also that I can be close to a community where there's a lot of opportunities to do things outside of work. Work is good and fun, but at the same time, um, I really like to be outdoors, go skiing, fishing, bike riding, hunting, um, you name it, we have it up here in Grass Valley. And so um, everybody else here at the police department seems to enjoy those types of activities as well. So there's a lot of opportunities to go out with your coworkers outside of work and have a great time in the community here.